Okay, we've got something special today. It's a 1999 Suzuki Hayabusa, the GSX 1300R. What we're gonna do, we're gonna grab the camera. Right, let's get a close look at this Hayabusa. It is HPI clear. There's lots of receipts in the pack with this. We've also got the V5 for it as well. well it's in really nice original condition. There are a couple of little marks on it, but it's to be expected of a bike of this old. This old it is a, it's a nice genuine bike, it's nice and clean, really, really low miles on it. We will have a look and get the exact mileage off it in a bit. So we'll just get a really good look all around it. Now what it has got on here, it's got uh, strategically placed in certain parts of it. The, 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 you know, the owners have put, it's like a heli tape, you know, to protect it. So it has protected it on the main, the main areas. But you can see like this, there's little marks there, that's in the heli tape. So it's been, it's been cut along there. You can see the heli tape on it. I mean, there are a couple of little stone chips and things like that on it, but it's much nicer to keep it genuine, I think. And let's get a look around the uh, front wheel, and get a good close look at the wheels. The wheels are really, really clean on this. Well, it's a nice colour, this one as well. It's like a, it's like a goldy bronze colour with a, like a champagne. It's got the nice Hayabusa logo on there. And it does look like this has been dry stored as well. I mean, it is really, really clean. Looks like it's done dry miles as well. There's no sort of oxidation on it, you know, on the, uh, on the alloy. Stands looking nice and shiny as well. It's just a nice, honest bike. Good collector's bike, these, these are, you know, they, they are gonna go up in value. I can't see it ever going down. Everything is, does look original on it as well. The original Suzuki exhaust on it. You can see how good the condition is there. It has been stored for a while. As you can see, the chain's got the surface rust on it. It's got the uh, paddock stand bobbins on as well. As you can see, the condition of the wheels there really nice and bright and shiny they have not seen much wet weather by the looks of them they've put loads of little just little protection there's like a carbon patch on there that they put on that to stop anywhere on the side there Get a look at the side plastics as well side of the tank again on the tank you can see they've rather than opt for the the big I think ugly looking tank pads, they've, they've put the uh, heli tape on that, you know, to protect it. And side panels as well on the plastic there, all in really good condition. Let's get a look over the top of the tank. Get looking at the, uh, at the yokes as well. On there it's got the Hayabusa carbon protector on there as well. No big bunch of keys either there, so there's no wear on that. There's no, no rubbing that's on the, uh, the yoke as well. So I'll have a look over the top of the seat as well, and the grab rail. Get a look at it from the back. Let's get a look at the uh, silences. You can see how clean those are as well. And we'll move over to this right hand side. We'll do the same again, we'll have a good look over the plastics. Side of the seat and the side of the tanks. Again, you can see it's got a carbon patch on there. Get a look over the side of the tank. All the levers and the bar ends. No scuffs or marks on there. Let's get a look over the fairing on this side. Bit easy to see this side because it's on the side stand. And 
again just really nice and clean again with the, everything standard standard genuine Suzuki pipes on it you can see how clean those wheels are so what we'll do we'll finish up and get a look at the front wheel on this right hand side okay, you can see this a little bit better on this side just see how clean those wheels are this looking really nice and clean as well in good condition so what we'll do we'll go and have a look up at the close look at the dash and the controls and we'll get the exact mileage off it right let's get a look up at the uh, controls so you've got your front brake which is reach adjustable you've got your kill switch your lights so you can switch your lights on and off on this because it's an older model you've got your starter on that side and we'll move over to the other side you've got your clutch which again is fully reach adjustable you've got your lights indicators horn and also the edge of this it's a manual choke so that's your choke on there you've also got adjustable forks on that so you can, you've got your hard and soft on the front forks so let's pop the ignition on see how many miles it's done and it's done just 16,082 so really low mileage for this one okay let's start this up listen to it run And there you go, if you like any more photos or videos, anything you want to see in close up, we can do that for you and send it over to you on WhatsApp. If you want to give Dawn or Dave a call on 0161 713 3219, they'll be happy to help you. Finance is available on this bike. We can also offer contactless free delivery anywhere in the mainland UK. There's also extended parts and labour warranty available and a 30 day money back guarantee. You can visit us online at www.somanybikes.com or you can call us by phone on 0161 713 3219 or you can call into our showroom in Greater Manchester by appointment only during these Covid restrictions.